Well, I've recently uh, decided to hang the boots up after playing professional rugby for 10 years. I graduated university in 2012, went straight into professional rugby. I spent the majority of my career with Wasps, I've most recently been at Sale Sharks and I've had um, a few surgeries and I had to retire most recently because of a bad knee after my sixth surgery on that. So decided to, while well, I still have a bit of function left in me, to uh, seek a new challenge and decide to do something else. What led me to pure sports medicine was the desire to regain some of my function. Being relatively young, 32 years old, I've spent the last 10 years getting daily medical intervention, so any time I've had an ailment or a bit of a niggle, anything I'm struggling with, I can go see a physio at work and they'll kind of helped me on the path to feeling better but after stopping in April having I guess my my daily routine changing not training full-time maybe I've become a bit slack with how I've looked after my body and I've subsequently <laughs> become I think immobile would be the best word so my knee is obviously a bit of a concern don't have much flexion in that uh, the things which aggravate that such as running lifting heavy leg weights, I've had to stop doing that. And that has now manifested into a bit of a back issue, which I have had some injections in while I was playing, which were kind of short-term pain relief injections. But now my back has ceased to function, I think is the way I describe it, such as I can't really bend over without support. Not in a sort of a super debilitating way, but I need to, if I'm emptying the dishwasher, for example, I need to put my hand on the, on the kitchen counter so I can bend down and uh, reach the plates. So then to go from performing physically and feeling comfortable with your ability to, as I said previously, not being able to do simple tasks such as empty the dishwasher has been somewhat challenging mentally. It's not a disaster but it's certainly a catalyst for wanting more for myself because I know how capable I can be and that's exactly why I'm here because I want to get my body to a place where I feel happy with myself. I think that's one thing about professional sport you kind of so on one of the double-edged sword so you do obviously get a lot of medical attention but you also understand that people can make you feel better I don't have the tools to structure a program to give myself what I need. You need to go somewhere where they have multiple services because you can't, not, it's not a one size fits all. So going somewhere where they can offer you different solutions for different problems under one roof or give you different little avenues to explore is encouraging. To get, piecing together a new program to get me prepared for a different way of life, you know, just becoming more mobile. Yeah, I'm very excited about <laughs> hopefully getting on a path to feeling good. Fortunately for me, it seems like we're in a position that we're going to be able to make some good progress and it's just only super positive, you know.